what we have here today, what we're installing is the 62 mil high compression big bore kit for a GY6. Here's the actual piston. As you can see, it has a slight dome on it. I'm sorry, the camera's kind of not adjusting because it's so bright. As you can tell, it has a dome on the top to give it that extra compression. So, so you can kind of see what the actual overall um, size is. This is the actual uh, gasket for this one, which is the 62 mil. And as you can see, it fits nice and uh, tight up against this. And now, if we put it over here, you can see how much more of opening it is compared to the stock cylinder side so that's what we're gonna be doing now and we're gonna have to remachine the bore inside here since it's just a little bit too small alright you got the uh, two halves bored out so you're going to be needing one of these uh, aluminum deburring bits because uh, or else if you use the regular steel ones, the ones that are meant for iron based metals, they, they're too fine and they clog up with aluminum. You definitely need to use these ones. And then after you pretty much got the case, the, uh, the cylinder kit will slide in then use uh, like a little cookie cleaner kind of thing to you know go in there kinda smoothing out what you can because let's face it you're not a machine you're never gonna get that perfect this is just to kinda you know make it look a little nicer alright now we got the crankshaft the timing chain in place uh, I recommend replacing those oil seals because you know, why not get that done while you're in there? Make sure when you're assembling it, just use some type of assembly lube because uh, the oil might take a couple of seconds for it to reach up uh, through all the spots on the motor. So at least this ensures it's not dry when it's first starting up. You know, make sure everything's all good. Well, finally have the uh, 150cc upgrade to a 174cc uh, kit done. Now I um, have it all put back together. It definitely has a bigger bore than the intake valve. It definitely has bigger, studs and bigger bore for the exhaust so I'm gonna modify the factory exhaust probably later get an upgrade but for now just need to bolt it all back up make sure it don't got no leaks so there's the scoot I just need to bolt it back up and I'll uh, get some more video on it Alright, so finally, we got it all set up. We got the GY6 in there. I'll put back together. I'll give it a quick little fire up. Let's see how it sounds like. Sounds good. So pretty much just need to do the break-in period before I could give you any performance videos on it. But hopefully you like the build. <laughs> 